In radio and television, it's RCA all the way. The Radio Corporation of America presents The Magic Key. key turns. 106 leading stations from coast to coast in the United States, in Canada, in Cuba, and in Hawaii are linked together today to bring you this full hour of radio entertainment coming to you direct from the stage of Music Hall in Cincinnati, Ohio. Your host is the family of RCA, whose members include RCA Victor, RCA Institute, Radio Marine, RCA Communications, and the National Broadcasting Company. Today, the Radio Corporation of America invites you to listen to the music of the Cincinnati Symphony Orchestra under the direction of the distinguished composer-conductor Eugene Goossens with Marjorie Lawrence, soprano of the Metropolitan Opera Company, as soloist. Mr. Goossens opens the program with the academic festival overture by Johannes Brahms. Based on four traditional student songs, the overture was written by Brahms in appreciation of an honorary degree conferred on him by the University of Breslau the Academic Festival Overture by Johannes Brahm. <laughs>
Our soloist today, Marjorie Lawrence, is very much in the modern operatic tradition, which says that prima donna should not only be fine singers, but that they should also be beautiful. For two years now, Miss Lawrence has been a leading dramatic soprano at the Metropolitan Opera Company. And this season, she was highly acclaimed for her singing in the Richard Strauss opera, Salome. The Magic Key takes pleasure in presenting the outstanding Victor recording artist, Marjorie Lawrence. Marjorie Lawrence sings the aria Divinité du Stix from von Gluck's opera Alceste, first performed before Queen Marie Antoinette in the 18th century.
Marjorie Lawrence, outstanding Victor recording artist, sings with harpsichord accompaniment the familiar Dido's Lament from Purcell's opera Dido and Aeneas, considered one of the finest achievements in the history of British music. RCA is no stranger to Cincinnati, scene of today's Magic Key broadcast, for two of Cincinnati's leading broadcast stations use RCA equipment. In one of Cincinnati's foremost moving picture theaters, the RKO Albi, is found RCA photophone sound picture equipment. And in hundreds of Cincinnati homes, RCA Victor radios provide modern radio reception of domestic and foreign broadcasts. That explains what we mean when we say, it's RCA all the way. It is this vast and thorough experience with radio and sound reproduction in all its branches which gives RCA Victor the capacity to lead. It is this experience and these resources which enable RCA Victor to maintain above standard quality in radio performance, yet provide this performance at sensationally low cost. As an example, the new RCA Victor radio model 87K2. This is a handsome, full-sized console featuring that ace of modern radio improvements, RCA Victor Electric Tuning. Just push a button, and there's your station. It also includes other ultra-modern features you ordinarily associate only with higher-priced sets. Magic Key, RCA Metal Tubes, and dozens of others. Yet its price is only $89.95 FOB Camden, New Jersey. Be sure to have your RCA Victor dealer demonstrate this spectacular radio to you before you purchase.
When Beethoven composed his Symphony No. 3, the Eroica Symphony, in 1804, he dedicated it to Napoleon as the Apostle of Liberty. But in May of that year, Napoleon accepted the title of Emperor. And when Beethoven heard the news, he ripped out the title page in a fury of disappointment. Eugene Goossens conducts the Cincinnati Symphony Orchestra in the Allegro Molto from Beethoven's Symphony No. 3.
When you tune in your local national broadcasting company station, you are participating through your loudspeaker in an institution which is just as much a pattern of your own locality as the schools, clubs, banks, and other organizations in your community. Your letters and other communications are treated with the utmost importance by the officials of every NBC station. And indeed, the audience preference is the principal guide used in selecting the programs which you hear in your own home. Whatever your favorite program, whether it's news, education, comedy, drama, music, or religion, your local NBC station tries to bring you the best of its type. Listen now for the familiar NBC chimes, your signal for fine radio entertainment. Magic Key turns, opening the door to a world of entertainment. Today, the family of RCA is presenting the Cincinnati Symphony Orchestra under the baton of the composer-conductor Eugene Goosens with the Metropolitan Opera Company dramatic soprano Marjorie Lawrence as soloist here on the stage of the Cincinnati Music Hall. Eugene Goosens opens the second half of our program with the delicate melodic shadings of Claude Debussy's Fête.
In the radio studio, time is a relentless taskmaster. We have no alternative but to obey the strict regulations of a precise electric clock. But when you play Victor Records at home, it's rather like keeping time with an old-fashioned hourglass. Just as soon as the sand runs through, you can reverse the glass and have your musical treasures all over again. And now there is little excuse for anyone to be without his own favorite music. Musical treasures on Victor Records in a library that is aloof from time that waits for you to choose the music you want when you want it. The Victor Record Society makes it easy for you. You do not even have to own a phonograph, for your membership in the society provides you with the famous RCA Victor Record player. This price, $14.95 at no extra cost. Visit your RCA Victor dealer and ask him to enroll you in the Victor Record Society. Pay the membership fee of $6 and purchase $9 worth of Victor Records, any record you choose. Just as soon as you've done that, the dealer turns over to you a brand new RCA Victor record player. This is the instrument, you know, which attaches to your radio and plays records through the loudspeaker. Your membership also makes you eligible for the Victor record dividends, which, in the course of time, equal the value of your membership fee. You receive, too, a year's subscription to the monthly publication, The Victor Record Society Review. These and other features of the Victor Record Society are unique in the annals of music. Surely you want to take advantage of this offer. See your RCA Victor music dealer tomorrow. Metropolitan Opera Company soprano and Victor recording artist Marjorie Lawrence returns to our program with a group of three songs by the great contemporary of Brahms, Hugo Wolf. First, Miss Lawrence sings Gebet, or prayer, beginning, Lord, to thy will I bow.
Marjorie Lawrence, Metropolitan Opera Company soprano, now sings Hugo Wolf's Der Rattenfinger, the light and gay melody which tells about a Pied Piper. <laughs> As a contrast in melodic mood, Miss Lawrence brings us for an encore the solemn invocation of Hugo Wolf's Gesang Velas. We know you have enjoyed the singing of this charming Metropolitan Opera star, Marjorie Lawrence. 
Hear her sing excerpts from Salome on Victor Records at your RCA Victor music dealer. From the original manuscript copy, the distinguished composer-conductor Eugene Goosens brings us the world radio premiere of the Bacchanal from his own composition, Three Nature Poems. Thank <laughs> you. 
the members of the family of RCA, RCA Victor, RCA Institutes, Radio Marine, RCA Communications, and the National Broadcasting Company invite you to tune in again at the same time next Sunday for another full hour of radio entertainment. At that time, the magic key will be dedicated to National Music Week, and you will hear the great American baritone, John Charles Thomas. Greetings from the chairman of the National Music Week Committee, David Sarnoff, and from the founder and secretary, C.M. Tremain. The Victor Glee Club of 45 Voices and Frank Black conducting the Magic Key Orchestra. <laughs> This is James Leonard speaking for all the services of the Radio Corporation of America. And Peter Grant saying that in radio and television, it's RCA all the way. This program has originated in Music Hall, Cincinnati, from radio station WLW, and has come to you through the National Broadcasting Company. <laughs>